Today let's talk about joy, how you can feel more of it and some essential oils to really just help you tap into that daily joy that is available to you. Hi, my name's Dee. Welcome back to my channel or welcome if you are new here. On this channel I share my love for well-being and living a healthy lifestyle and my passion for aromatherapy. So if that is something that you are interested in, please consider subscribing. I would absolutely love to have you here. So first up, I have a question for you. Do you feel joy in your life? I've got some notes here that I'm going to refer to just so I don't get too off track or forget to say anything. But I think this is a really important question. Do you feel joy in your life on a daily basis? Connecting to joy is something that can really, really change your day. It can change your outlook and improve your life both long and short term. So let's just talk a little bit about what we mean by joy. Uh, the dictionary defines joy as the emotion of great delight or happiness caused by something exceptionally good or satisfying. Personally, I think of joy as being a feeling of pure contentment, just a real lightness of being, a glow that seems to come from your soul. I actually find it a little bit difficult to really explain because just the feeling of the word joy, the energy of it really encapsulates for me what it actually is. So the word itself, I feel like it just explains itself. I'm not sure if that makes sense, but it's just like, I guess joy is just that joy. It's this real, yeah, just kind of inner feeling. I feel like there's no other word to really <laughs> describe what it is. I know that sounds really strange, but yeah, it is a happiness. It is a lightness. It is a, yeah, just a sense of vibrance and yeah, just, just like a nice, it's just a beautiful, beautiful energy to be in. I also think that giving joy brings you more joy. So when you feel joy and share joy, you actually spread joy and it comes back to you tenfold. Yeah, it just creates a ripple effect out into the world that has a vast effect on people and things that we may never even know about. You may change someone's day by helping them find joy and they in turn change someone else's day and so on and so on and so on. It really is just this ripple effect and it can just be by the smallest, smallest thing, just like smiling at someone in the checkout line at the supermarket or letting them go before you. Yeah, it can just be the smallest, smallest thing that can just bring that little bit of joy into someone's day, but at the same time really change their day and how they are feeling. And that makes us feel good. That make, Well, I don't know about you, but I think when we make somebody else feel good, then we just feel good as well. And that brings us joy. <laughs> it goes in circles. So how can you actually bring more joy into your life? I'm going to talk about two things. One is gratitude and the second is aromatherapy and we'll go into the essential oils then. But I think gratitude is just a great way to start finding joy in just the smallest of things or moments in your day, in your life. When you find things that bring you joy, I think it's important to just like allow yourself to feel that joy. Just stop, whether it's like a beautiful, you know, blue sky with some fluffy clouds or the sunset or the moonrise. I went and watched the moonrise last night and it was just beautiful. Just allowing yourself that moment to feel that joy in your soul, in your body. Yeah, it's just, it's important to do that and express gratitude for that. Express gratitude for the actual thing that has brought you that joy and then express gratitude for actually that feeling of joy that you have experienced. And when we do this, it just attracts more of it into our life. What we concentrate on, what we focus on is what we attract. And so, yeah, when we have that little focus on joy and gratitude, then those things are going to come to us 
in a greater way. And we focus on those things, we bring more of those things into our life. I hope that makes sense. <laughs> just a really nice thing to do in terms of gratitude is just write down three things every day that yeah, have brought you joy, that you are grateful for in your life. And it's just a really simple yet really powerful practice. I do that every night or most nights. I th I'm kind of telling a little bit of a lie here because in August I have not been doing it, but I have. I normally have a page in my journal which is just a daily gratitude note and I have like the days just numbered and I just write three things down and I actually haven't done it this month but what I've done is created a page for August and I'm just going to write down the end of the month some things that have brought me real joy and that I'm grateful for this month. So however you like to do it but I think it's a lovely lovely practice. The second and most beautiful way, I mean there are many ways of course that you can bring more joy into your life, uh, but aromatherapy is a beautiful, beautiful way to help you feel joy and to help you expand that feeling of joy or the amount of joy that you have in your life. So yeah, essential oils just really help, help you tap into more joy and to connect to that deep feeling of joy. And so I thought I would share some essential oils. How many have I got here? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven essential oils that will really, or that I guess are my favorites that will really help you to connect to that feeling of joy and what it means for you. So whichever ones you, out of these, or there might be a different one that you are attracted to, use that essential oil. In your daily life to bring that little bit more joy into your life. So the first one is cardamom and it helps you to restore an appetite for life. It reminds us of the true abundance that surrounds us. It is great for improving motivation, clarity of thought, openness, joy and inspiration. It's a really nice warming, I guess comforting essential oil. It's, yeah, it's great for connection. The second one is geranium, and this is a beautiful, beautiful balancing oil. That is the first word that comes to mind when I think of geranium. But it helps us connect to a feeling of security, strength, and calm, leading to an increased ability to experience pleasure and to receive joy and the gifts of life that we desire. I love geranium. <laughs> Number three is jasmine. This this oil is just so intoxicating and magical. I just love it. It hits pessimism, pessimism on the head. So if you're just feeling like there is no way you can feel joyful at the moment, jasmine might be the oil for you. Helps reduce moodiness, especially in times of stress and nervous exha exhaustion. It almost instantly replaces a bad mood with a feeling of joy. Yeah, so if you're feeling down or even just upset about something or yeah, just not feeling in any way connected to joy, jasmine is absolutely beautiful. The next one is lime, and lime is the oil for inspiration, for positive energy, for joy, and for vitality. It enhances fun, laughter, and an appetite for life. So yeah, just a really, I guess, kind of energizing, positive, optimistic oil. The next one is orange. Orange brings strength along with a beautiful, beautiful lightheartedness for your mind, body and soul. It helps create joy, love, communication and pleasure in your day. And it brings with it self-assurance, courage and happiness. So it's just, again, it's, yeah, just a really beautiful, I kind of feel like it's a nourishing oil. It's a beautiful warming citrus. Yeah, and, and does bring that lightheartedness into your life. The next one I've chosen is rose because I feel like rose is this oil that is just fabulous for falling in love with life. If you've fallen out of love, love with life, <laughs> rose is for you. And yeah, it just helps you fall in love with your life and whatever 
living a beautiful, full, joyful life means for you. It's very refreshing to the soul, bringing joy and love to your heart and just renewing your sense of well-being. It's just a, oh, it's just a beautiful, beautiful oil. Love. Love is the word that comes to mind with rose. Love and joy. The last one I have to share with you is vanilla and vanilla is deeply, deeply soothing and harmonizing. At the same time, it's emotionally uplifting and helps to create a feeling of calm. So sometimes we just need to calm down to allow that joy into our life. And yeah, it just allows you to connect to the feelings of joy and bliss on a real soul, deep level. It's just, yeah, it's just oh, lovely oil. I love, 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 love vanilla. Um, yeah, so as always, as I said um, in the beginning, well, not in the beginning, but when I started talking about essential oils, Please use whatever essential oil you are most drawn to. That is going to be the one for you. And with these essential oils, you can just use a single essential oil and you can just inhale it from the bottle. That is just like a, or put a drop on a tissue that it, and just inhale it. That is a beautiful way to use essential oils. Or you might like to just put a single essential oil into your diffuser or you could make a really nice, simple blend to use. And I've got three here to share with you today. So the first one is three drops of orange and one drop of cardamom for just a really warming, joyful feeling. The next one is three drops of lime, two drops of rose and one drop of jasmine for just a beautiful, uplifting, optimistic, inspiring, joyful, loving blend. <laughs> Number three is three drops of orange, one drop of geranium and one drop of vanilla. So for a nice balancing yet light-hearted, calming, soothing blend. Yeah, that, that is perfect for adding a bit of a joy into your life. All of these blends just in your diffuser will just really help you connect to that feeling of joy. And as I said to just expand into that feeling of joy. I think that is all that uh, I have to share with you today. But yeah, I just, I just really wanted to yeah, just to share these ways of tapping into joy because sometimes I think we we fall into the stress and worry of the day, of our work, of our, you know, whatever's going on in our life. And yes, those worries and those stresses are absolutely valid, but there is always just that small little Thing that we can connect to to bring us a little bit of joy in that chaos that we might feel sometimes. Yeah. So I hope this video has been helpful. Please like and subscribe if you enjoyed and, and share with someone who you think this might be helpful for. And I will see you in another video very, very soon.